Many of you who come from an Angular 1 background must be used to Bower in order to install your libraries. However, with Angular 2 and TypeScript and Webpack, this is a little bit different. So I'm going to take Lodash as an example because it's very useful. And Lodash by nature is made for Node.js and it's done in CommonJS. So there's no typing for it. So what you need to do is just to go to your terminal, npm install, your lodash, perfect. And after that, one last thing that you need to do is to do typings and install lodash. And hopefully, if this library is famous enough, you're going to have typings that have been created just for this. For TypeScript. So now that you got your typings downloaded, you can see that in your typings folder here in browser, which is browser.dish.ts here, you will see that these types have been installed in definitions here, lodash. So now you will not have errors when you will load your lodash. So I'm gonna use my main here. And just make a quick example of how to import Lodash because that's not that hard. You got to do import like that as underscore from Lodash. So I repeat, this is only because Lodash isn't an Angular 2 module, just like jQuery, for example. So now that you got your underscore, as for example, you can do an underscore dot h and you can do a one, two, three and a function and number and we're just gonna do some alerts with number and reload. one, two, and three. So that's how you install a library that is not Angular 2 ready yet.